you really need to kind of streamline your CV and I would say keep it to one page. Put on there if, you, if you've got your driving license, it's very important. Um, and also if you're a car owner, that's a good thing to put down. List any courses. Obviously, you might want to list this course that you're doing um, as one that you've done. Obviously, any first aid, if you've done any um, health and safety training, then list those. Keep it clean. Like, use your word skills. Use all your kind of data, you know, your processing skills. You know, use bullet points. Make it, make it fancy. Make it clean. Because especially if you're trying to get a job in production, that's what your coordinator will be impressed with. When I started out... Uh I would, I would read everything. Someone told me just read everything, even though it was probably confidential. As long as I kept the confidence, kept it with me, you know, if you sent something off to be photocopied, it, you know, have a quick read. Because it, it's always good to know that leads to that and that leads to that. If you find yourself at any point on the floor with nothing to do, there isn't, that isn't the excuse to go and find somebody to go and talk to. There isn't an excuse for you to wander off and go to your car for a minute or to go and get yourself a cup of tea. If you've got nothing to do, if you can't, with your initiative, find something to do, whether it's asking the crew, do we want water? Whether it's asking the DOP and the director, do you like a cup of tea? If you can't find something to do, go to 3rd D and say, a bit of a loose end, what he's doing? A professional attitude uh, at all times. Uh, being courteous, old school manners. If unit call is eight o'clock, do not get to work for eight o'clock. If breakfast is at seven, get to work at seven. One of the best things to move forward is to just have even that one little chance on something, no matter how small you think it is, go and do it, because you might meet someone else who's going to go and do another job somewhere else. The more you kind of do little bits like that, it soon adds up and soon you've got like five or six people that you can work for. So, I, I, you know, any little thing, don't turn down. People ask me, you know, what do you think is the most important thing that a runner can bring to a production? And I think it's integrity. And integrity is a really huge um, pillar for all the runners and junior people coming on to film sets, it's privacy, it's, it's the non-disclosure agreements that you have to sign. We, work, we live in an age now where everything can be tweeted and Facebooked within seconds. And the best runners are the runners that have integrity, the best filmmakers are the ones that have integrity. Mm -hmm.